just start. Eh, fair enough. Hmm. But the, the Chip and Dale thing looks better than I expected, honestly. It's I one of those, it. it's one of those, like, uh, reboot the things that, like, I just expect to be low effort. <laughs> no, except it's not even a reboot. Not reboot, but just kind of like, woohoo, guys, remember this? Like, that kind of thing. Oh, like, there hasn't been, there hasn't been a Chip and Dale. Yeah, like, there hasn't been a Chip and Dale media in, like, at least a decade. <laughs> yeah, and, that, and it's definitely playing off of that, being, like, the whole, like, oh, guys, mm. like... They're they're washed up now. Ooh, Remember the, those good old days? Ooh, the people who watch this as kids are old enough to have money now. Let's uh, let's 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 <laughs> let's well, benefit I mean, from we, that. All right. We've talked about before how you know the nostalgia market is very very real. Mm-hmm. Well, it works. Why wouldn't they do it? Hell, I'm a sucker for it. Hmm. I am sometimes. Mm. Yeah, sometimes. Only if it's actually fucking good. If you're nostalgia baiting me and it's not good, you just go fuck yourself, Lamau. <laughs> Don't ruin my baby. Me at you, Defong. Where? Head. Head. <laughs> head. Head, yeah. Head. It was just on my YouTube front page. It just made me laugh. Just head. <laughs> now. <laughs> ah. I got a big funny ulcer on the inside of my lip. Oh, Ooh, it's cool. Mmm. Been there for a couple of days and I don't like it. <laughs> As I keep drinking coffee. <laughs> you gotta watch out for those, those, those heart palpitations. Woohoo! <laughs> So, I don't know, there was like a few things I was thinking about uh, at mm. work today. Oh. Like, uh, one of them I was thinking about, like, um, on the way home from work, uh, I'll get to that in a little bit. Um, I, I don't know, how's your day been so far? I'm guessing you just woke up a couple hours ago. <laughs> yeah, woke up, still sick, ate food, <laughs> lol. Yeah, understandable. I want to watch the video that Relic put. <laughs> I'm gonna it's, have to. Uh, I'm gonna mute the tab. <laughs> it, it's something. <laughs> it's even better without the sound. <laughs> Based on your response to it, what they're talking about is stupid. Who cares? Yeah. <laughs> you're either moving or you're not moving. That's all that matters. Yeah, I guess so. Hmm. Doesn't matter how you move, as long as that base movement is there, it should work fine. It should. <laughs> yeah. You don't have to do any of this fancy shit. <laughs> I guess not. I don't even know sometimes. Hmm. Oh, hey, that's right. It's day 15, so the one mm -hmm. mim the one gimmick account is there, and, you know, it's there on my timeline. Give it up for day 15. What? It's the 15th of the month. I mean, yeah, I know that, but what? There's a moment in SpongeBob SquarePants where Mr. Krabs shouts, Give it up for day 15! Oh, from the one where they're open 24 hours. Oh, 
Right, that's the episode. I honestly forgot what it was. Mm hmm. It's like one of the only uh, episodes I actually remember. Yeah. Let me just do a quick type just to get the kitty to recognize me. Hmm. I'll do it as well, cuz fuck it. Cat's gonna wave at the streamer. Hmm. Hello, pussy. Hahaha. <laughs> Feel like that. We made a rhyme. I said cat. You said fat. Hmm. Yeah. That was the goal. That's what makes us gamers. We're so fucking funny. <laughs> oh. Oh. It's like one of the first things, um... I don't know, it's like... There's just some days, some days at work, it was kind of funny. I hmm. was, uh, I was talking to my supervisor, um, and I was like, uh, I don't know, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to, um, reach the... reach the order number by the end of the month. Now, granted, you know, we still have, um, this week and next week to get it done. Um, we have to have, like, 720, at least for my line, 720 units by the end of the month. Mm. Um, and there's been a big backup, the backup being, you know, just uh, a lot of the parts that I've been waiting on just weren't available, and only, like, yesterday they finally started showing up. No. No, Fridays started showing up. Um, and uh, I've been sitting on, like, the first pallet's worth uh, of parts you know, still not finished, needing like 30 more. And, uh, yeah, might finally get that first pallet out by the end of this week, maybe. <laughs> um, but my, my supervisor, like, you know, he, he kept me calm. He said, like, hey, you know, more, more of a, more of your parts are going to be ready. Um, like, there are more parts that are, um, somewhere around here. Yeah, I found, I found some more of them, which is good. Um, and, one of the big ones, Swivel Nuts, and they should hopefully be ready by, Swivel you know, nut. yeah, hopefully by Thursday at the latest so that I can actually get the freaking pallet out by Friday. Um, but I don't know, it's, it's just this whole thing, but I feel a little more confident that we can get the parts out. And mm -hmm. aside from that, it's like, while I was actually working, um, I was thinking about, so, like, obviously yesterday was Valentine's Day. Let's get that over. Happy late Valentine's Day, everybody! Ooh. Um, I had a good day. Uh, I obviously can't speak for you, but me personally, I had a good day. <laughs> I was there. <laughs> <laughs> you existed. Well, I, I wish you a happy Valentine's Day. I wish Cream yeah. a happy Valentine's Day. We were being gay. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, I don't know. For all, I had a pretty good Valentine's Day. <clears throat> um, like Richter made a red velvet cake. Off, you know, I showed you the photo of that. Yeah. Um, and it was, it was, it's, it's still in the fridge. It's delicious. Um. Well, some could, some could say that the cake was a delicious bitch. <laughs> no, uh, that's you. <laughs> no, that's the cake. You can't. You can eat cake. You can't eat me. Don't take that out of context. Mm -hmm. I'll I'll prove you wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Get that one video you made, Gucci time. <laughs> I was thinking about that this morning, cause like I woke up and Richter just tells me, uh, uh right when she wakes up, and then Fen's Fen's on the bed next to her, Gucci time, and then I'm immediately thinking of the Payday Two music playing. <laughs> Raise the Wire is the best song in Payday. I don't care what people say. It is the best it is one. A song. It's <laughs> that and Don't Act Dumb. Best two songs in Payday. <laughs> so I will, I will say I don't know the Payday soundtrack very well. Mm. So it's like if you were to tell me um, one of the tracks, I wouldn't be able to know it. I would just know it by sound. Uh, yeah, no, that that's the best part about it. It's like you, even if you have no idea about like any of the names of the songs in Payday. You can hear a song and go, yeah, that's a Payday song. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> and uh, I just realized you titled the stream, Driving and Screaming and Furiously ma uh, Laughing at Funny Jokes. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what do you mean? <laughs> what? what, do you what? Mean? This is a funny joke. <laughs> it's a funny joke. Yeah. I... 
I'm about to, so I'm about to get serious for a sec, mm -hmm. but I was, um, <laughs> excuse me. I was wishing a friend, um, I was wishing a friend earlier a happy early Valentine's Day. Mm. And, um, I was talking to them because, like, I, I started thinking about, like, mid sentence. I was thinking about, it, I'm like, oh my god, I've known her for, it's about to be, like, if it hasn't already, it's in, like, a couple days, about to have been, like, four years. Mm. Um, and, you know, this is just once again talking about, like, passage of time, blah, 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 but it's like, I was talking to her about how I've, um, how I've seen her grow as a person in that time, and, um, even though she might not, she might not, um, think it, I have, I, like, I have seen that personal growth within her, and... Metal it's metal, it's just been you know it's been great to watch and I will still keep standing by as a friend no matter what and other hokey sappy things um but um she said to me you know that uh thanks for being my friend for so long and still talking and checking up on me even when I go silent you know that that sort of thing just means a lot and um and this is um like this part just kind of almost made me tear up, and it's like, it's still, like, it's maybe 7 o'clock in the morning for me. Um, mm. Actually, no, it was like 8.30 when I was reading this, but this part of what she said was, um, finding someone who understands how to give space and have as much patience as you do is rare. Mm. That is um, very true. Uh, you are uh, way yeah, too patient. <laughs> I it is am impressive. So patient, it's <laughs> I'm so patient. Sometimes it's a detriment. Mm-hmm. Understandable. I used to be like that. <laughs> like, and then I, I got fucking tired of people. <laughs> I so, I, believe me, working retail for so long. Mm. Um, I, I've talked about it many times before. Yeah. Working at a gas station, just working in retail in general. I did learn more patience. Mm. But at the same time, mm. I did become more uh, easily agitated by people. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, and with that said, it's like I ended up learning more patience by getting out of retail <clears throat> and just, um, I definitely, like, during, while I was still working at Applejack Wine Spirits, um, I. I was easily, like, becoming super irritable again. Because, mm. you know, it's just it's just what retail does. You can you can tell a lot of times if someone works retail with how irritable they are and how easily agitated they get. Mm. Um, so the fact that I still had any patience at all for people outside of work is, like, impressive. <laughs> To toot my own horn, it's impressive. Mm-hmm. You're a strong bitch. And <laughs> I... As strong as you are delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Why... <clears throat> I definitely, again, aside from working retail, I definitely did get all this patience just from my mother. Mm. Like... And my grandmother, for that matter. It's... It's definitely just this... It's borderline genetic. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, I get that. I was just... I was just raised to be... You know, very patient with people. And to give people... What are we waiting for? A chance. Two chances. Sometimes three chances. Mm-hmm. Now I've reached a point in my life where it's like, hey, okay... Three strikes, you're out. Rule. Mm -hmm. but, um... I'm kind of. It depends on the person. Like, yeah. If you're, if if I know, like, you won't, f like, if I know you're trying, I'll give you as many chances as needed. Exactly. But it, the, if you're that type of person, one strike, get the fuck. <laughs> get. <clears throat> I feel like we if know you... we know one person I'm talking about. XD. <laughs> Probably. But I, in my case, it's like, look. If you messed up that badly Ooh. the first time... <laughs> okay. Go on. <laughs> physics. 
if you really didn't mess up that badly with me the first time, there is a problem with you. I don't care how you try and spin it mm. and you try and make me look like the asshole. There is something wrong with you. I wonder who this is. <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> um, you know, it's... To quote... To quote my dad... Um, with my old... With my old friend, DJ. You'd have to, you know, and I'm repurposing it for myself, which I know that's going to seem egotistical in a way but I mean, yeah. it's a it's a valid reason for it honestly <laughs> it's something that i still agree with uh about about my old friend um mm. is that and again i think in a way i can apply this to myself you have to be a real asshole to not like me hmm and I hesitated saying that because again it's like that sounds so that sounds so braggadocious like oh you don't like me <laughs> you must be a real asshole but it's like <laughs> I'm I'm giving you a chance I mean I'm... coming for coming from someone who isn't you to make it less egotistical you are really not like it is really hard to dislike you it is really like, <laughs> yeah, you're mm. you're definitely not the. You are the you are a really that. you are a really likable person. <laughs> it's like I tell everyone, I just try my best. Mm. I really do. I try my best. I do too. Just... I'm just worse at it. <laughs> <laughs> XD. I like, I, like I I do my best to both be professional, but also to just. Hmm. Be approachable. Yeah. Uh, like I, uh, you know, I made a poll on Twitter earlier. Oops. And I just accidentally bumped my pop filter. Didn't even hear it. Well, that's good. <laughs> um, I had a. You know, uh, yeah, yeah, it has like two uh, votes on it. Anyway. Uh, anyway. <laughs> um, we'll pretend we didn't see that. <laughs> you can't get it's out of any the... difficult situation. <laughs> I'm uh, gonna keep pretending to not see it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> anyway, it's on the topic of like being seen as pre uh, uh, presentable and Reason. such. It's you know I <sighs> I don't know what it is about me on Twitter. Like you know I I ask the question again. Like do I come across as quote unquote popular to you? With my choices being, yes, and you scare me. Yes, but we like you. No, but a little scared. And the right answer, LMAO, no. No, no that's the wrong answer. You're, you're a disgusting poppy fur and everyone hates you. <laughs> it's like the exact opposite. It's like the, Someone says the truth. It's like the exact opposite of the truth, but you know. I mean, b just strictly speaking, numbers-wise, I would call you popular. You have almost 2,000 okay. people who looked at your account and went, Yeah, I like that. <laughs> well, but even then... And you still like get, it... like, quite a lot of interaction on a lot of your, your posts. Like, statistically speaking, I'd call that popular. But you don't, well... act, you don't act, quote unquote, popular because you're not a piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> and from my perspective, because it's like, you know, you have to take into account, like, how many of those accounts are maybe a bot account, how many are just, um... Yeah, but I'm talking, like, interactions and stuff. Like, you get good interactions with a lot of your tweets. <laughs> and I'm speaking, uh... like, actual popular, not, like, not fucking internet influencer, like, oh, yeah, two million likes, oh, that's not enough. Like, I don't give a fuck about that shit. The internet is a plague. <laughs> Yeah, I guess so. But like, I, I'd say you're well, fat. So... You're not super popular, obviously, but like reasonably popular. I I do like in a um, good way because there were <laughs> there were uh, two comments. Um, mm. One by a um, by a mutual friend um, that just says pandas are scary and the letter R scary. Mm. Um, 
And I'm just like, dang, I need to make myself less scary. And uh, one other comment saying, uh, IMO, you give off the same vibes as an internet micro-celebrity, but that's not inherently bad. Hmm. And your stream just stopped. Oh? There it goes. Okay. She's back. Okay. <laughs> But My OBS the, isn't case, saying anything, so it might have just, just been your Twitch dying. Get, <laughs> just in case it didn't get picked up. Um, well, I mean, OBS probably caught it. Um, yeah, I so I commented on it saying like that I'm I'm more than certain I'm not even a micro celebrity. I'm a D class no. micro micro celebrity. I mean, I, would, I, I just wouldn't I call you an anything celebrity. You're just a well-known, no. nice person. <laughs> and I think that's the best way to look at it, mm. is that I recognize that I'm, a I'm fucking reaching nobody. this point XD, like, anyone, go on. I am... <laughs> Lord. And so I'm reaching this point of um, where I recognize that I am getting recognized. Hmm. You've been uh, getting recognized for like two years now. <laughs> I, you don't I know, like guess. even when you didn't have a lot of followers. Like so many artists and stuff always say like, yeah, they're a great person. <laughs> like yeah, everyone, I, pretty much everyone who knows you is like, yeah, you're great. <laughs> I I have been. Uh, I still remember um, the artist Kinku. She like. She wanted to do an appreciation post for uh for commissioners mm. because um she wanted to just give a shout out to um people that like don't get enough uh don't get enough res uh, respect um and again mm. that's just like good commissioners or clients um and tagging me as like one of the one of the best people she's ever worked with. Mm. And I I have been told by a few that like I'm just I am one of the best people they've ever worked with. Where I'm just like, you know, I'm I'm responsive um, when I need to be. I uh, I have you know a general guideline of what it is that I want, um, but I give plenty of room for leeway. Hmm. You know, I provide a reference image, but I'm always like, eh, something like this. It doesn't have to be exact. Just, you know, yeah. whatever you come up with. <laughs> I'm like that too, post. but I also just don't commission often because I'm broke. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Mm. I, uh... I also, mo most of the reason that I'm very lenient with, like, how I word my commissions is because they'll send back, like, the sketch or something and I won't remember what I asked for. <laughs> So I'm just like, yeah, that look, that looks fine. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's right. Hmm. So a lot of the time, because like artists know, they know more than me about art. So like, I'm usually just like, go go for something like this. But if you want to change something, go for it. Like, if you think it'll look better in a different way, do it. Yeah. <laughs> I. So uh, I don't remember if I've. I'm pretty sure I talked mentioned this at least once. Um. I know it was, uh, I at least brought this up, um, with Chloe on, uh, which mm. I'm just, just mm. going to check and make sure. He's not there. Okay, no. Okay. He'll, us um, he'll usually fart in chat before he comes in. True. Mm. Um, the, so the thing that I remember, uh, it was the Conker's Bad for a Day little let's play from, uh, the director of the game and voice of Conker, Chris Siever, and, um... Mm. I forget the other two names. It was uh, Chris Sutherland and I forgot the last name. But, and Chris. Um, something that they point out, and it's when uh, when you first die in the game, you are greeted by Greg the Grim Reaper. Now, one of the noteworthy things about Greg, considering the limitations of Nintendo 64, is um, noticing the little animations he does on his fingers. Hmm. Um, I should play Conker Chris Huber, at some point. Uh, basically, stream. he just he kind of he talks about that, um, just appreciating the little finger movements and mm. uh, again for a Nintendo sixty four game, how well animated he is, uh, mm. how he's you know he's very lively. 
Uh, and basically what he points out is like when the uh, when the animators for the game were like, um, all right, well, what do you want him to do? Uh, how do you want this to look? And then his response to them, his res res response to them was, I don't know. You're the animator. Just make it look nice. <laughs> yeah. Which they pretty much like, how I, oh, pretty much okay. how I feel about a lot of like stuff I get is like, how do you like? I don't know how I want it. I want it to look nice. I want I want good. <laughs> you're you're the one who's good at making good. Don't don't ask me. I'm fucking stupid. I, g to I gave he... up on her. <laughs> yeah. To which, and yeah, same. To which he, um, you know, as he as he says, and I agree with this philosophy. When you give, when you give artists that much freedom, it, it will allows be better. them. <laughs> yeah, it allows them the chance to uh, to experiment hmm. and to make little touches that look nicer, like the finger movements. So basically, you know. Don't be one of those picky people that mm. are like it has to look exactly like this down to a T. Oh, like I'll be I'll be picky about like certain things, but most of the yeah. time I won't care. Like even if someone like draws like my character wrong, like if it's a small thing, eh. <laughs> Yeah. Like the the countless amount of pictures I have of skinny Ashley where, do, where I'm just like, eh. <laughs> who cares? Yeah. Who cares? Like, she's supposed to be fat, but who cares? <laughs> if it looks good, I, I don't care. <laughs> yeah. So, with, with all that said, and I know I went on a complete tangent That's about... That's the point of these streams. Uh, what I was, I know, and it does help time go go along. But mm. with all that said, um, to get back on the point, it's like once again thinking about knowing someone for so long and still being. I'm, I'm gonna be blunt. Sometimes it's hard to be friends with someone for so long. Mm, I get that. Cause like you know, we as humans, we change we adapt we uh things just happen and uh we either change for the better or we become They're not a dick. better mm. yeah so you either change for I'm the just... better or you get 30,000 followers on twitter <laughs> <laughs> Or you get one million. Hmm. Oof, I was gonna say something really petty. Indirect, but really petty. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you know, no no one will know. Just <laughs> I was gonna be really indirectly petty and say, uh, how's that safe for work comic project going? <laughs> Very direct, but no one will know who I'm talking about unless they already know. <laughs> Even I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, well, you should know who it is, because it's it's, it's me talking about them <laughs> and being petty. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. I, mm. I'm actually like I. It's probably someone that I just don't follow anymore. So I'm just like. Uh, no, you don't. You don't. <laughs> Right, so yeah, I definitely, I'm definitely like, I, I don't know. Well, it's one person that would oh, give me a reason to be pay. The one, yeah, the fair. one person. <laughs> yeah, that's totally fair. Mm. And you know, it cer that certainly narrows it down. I'm sure I can easily guess, but you know, <laughs> respectively, I'll guess after stream. <laughs> but uh. I I I think about time like too often. Mm, I um, get that. And it's also just strange, like I guess. Think about how much time I'm people... wasting. <laughs> <laughs> once well, once more, people change as we get older, and we um, I don't know. It's like because some you know my oldest friends in Florida, um, you know I've known them for 
almost 20 years. Like, DJ, I did know for 20 years, but mm. I got a whole other story. I don't um, think I've had, I don't think I've ever had a friendship that has lasted more than five years. Yeah, I think my, I think my longest I, friendship was four years, and that's just because we were in school together. Yeah. Like, as soon as I, as soon as I left that school, I never spoke to them again. And the longest friend that I've had, like, online? Um, in terms of, like, at least someone that you I'm guys. still somewhat, <laughs> somewhat actively talking to? Mm. Uh, it's been almost six years. Hmm, nice. Yeah, I think for me it's you guys. It's 2022 now, when did we meet? I think it was like early uh, or late. Yeah, it was like early 2019, I think. It was so think it was March, March summer... or February. I know it was somewhere. Oh, that's the wrong side of the road. Hello. It was... No, it was uh, <laughs> it was during the summer. Hmm. Um, I think we joined I the. the I think our first interaction <laughs> was in March, but we didn't really like become friends until later that year. Yeah, and it was. Um... I think Mon. Is the is the longer is the person I've known longest? Yeah, I can believe that. Mm -hmm. I think he was like uh, one of the first people I talked to on that server. Yeah, and I. Which is a petty part two, which is now dead. Which is. <laughs> <laughs> I think that narrows it down a lot more for you. <laughs> yeah. <definitely. laughs> well, anyway. Hold on, they wanted to make a save for comic since when? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, I... Exit left. I don't know, it's it's wild thinking about, like, you know, how some people I... Again, like, even with you, we've never met in person, and hmm. yet we're... And yet we are still close friends, and it's like... Oh, yeah. It's it's just Honestly, wild. I'm glad we haven't met in person yet cuz if you met me if you met me in person when we first met, you wouldn't have liked me. You <laughs> Like I can That's almost totally I can good. almost guarantee you would have hated me if we had met in person back then. <laughs> And you, and I guess, uh, if that were the case, then by now you would have been like, you know, I, <laughs> I regret. I, I honestly, with you, I don't know if I would have, would have disliked you. Because <laughs> at least back then, like, even in person, you seemed like, a, I mean, to other people that from what I've heard, you were good, you were nice in person. Back then, who? <laughs> <laughs> just there was there was a lot of dishonesty <laughs> online I, I will be yeah <laughs> i understand mm. yeah i lord knows i've experienced quite a bit of that dishonesty in person let's just um, say i have became a, a very good liar <laughs> since yeah. since like 2018 2017 <laughs> i don't i mean not anymore i don't use it anymore because lying is fucking annoying <laughs> no i can uh i can get behind like i totally get what you mean because there was a point in time where i was a good liar too mm. and i mean i, but I, I usually I, so in a kind I of weird do mm. it I would usually do it, like, just to get myself out of a bad situation. Yeah, that's pretty much what I would do with it. Which, like, I was gonna say, like, to kind of, I guess, I, I guess in a bad way, <laughs> toot my own horn, I'm probably still pretty good at lying. I just don't. <laughs> yeah. Because it's um, a shitty thing to do. Yeah, it's like, you know, it's... <sighs> There are times when telling the truth seems like it'll hurt, mm. but lying will always hurt more in the long run. Yeah. So in that case, like, I, I get it. The truth is scary. Mm-hmm. But... I'd rather give you the relief of knowing it straight away than me lying to you you yeah. thinking things are fine and then getting slapped in the face with the truth later on because that's just that's just a double that's just a double whammy because one the bad thing has has you figured out about the bad thing and two y you know someone just lied to you <laughs> yeah 
Like, I don't I, want that I'm, kind of distrust from people. You know, I'm, even I'm even if people that. like, I, hmm? even if people don't like me, I want people to trust me. Yeah. I would wa I would rather someone not like me, but at least believe what I say, than someone like have to be cautious with everything I say, whether on like yeah. wonder like is she telling the truth? Is she being a dumb bitch? Like. <laughs> You might need to take everything she says with a grain of salt. Hmm. Uh, it even reminds me. Of, <laughs> it like even reminds me. I was a. Uh, I was looking through, um, I guess PayPal contacts or whatever earlier. Mm. Um, and I only just realized on the app that yeah. um you can block certain people. Yeah. Um and yeah, I I saw two names in Pennsylvania that. XD. I, I was like. Oh, you're both showing up on my PayPal uh, block. Block. Mm. Okay. Now, now, for certain, I don't think I'm ever gonna see or hear from you two ever again. <laughs> nice. Lord knows. I. Hmm. Mm. Yeah. Uh, those. Those were some liars. Lamel. <laughs> them out and mm -hmm. ranting and you're like I friggin because they lied to me and I did lie back because like well oh, okay fight fire with fire yeah. but okay, we're getting to I don't know we're getting yeah, to if you're, if you're a piece of shit I will lie to you <laughs> I mean, yeah. you, you don't de you don't deserve honesty from me if you're not being honest to me <laughs> yeah you don't deserve that treatment so instead of lying to me just lie down with me. Hey! Oh, wow, sex. Get the dough. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why the fake laugh always gets me. It was, oh god, what was it? Like ages ago, it was like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> I don't even remember what we were talking about. I had no idea. I just remember it was making No, it was it was dead by daylight. Because we're like, oh, oh yeah. get looped! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, dead by daylight. Now that's a game where in a way you have to lie by uh being like, oh I'm Sneaky going this beaky. way. But actually I was going this way. Yeah, you gotta dupe. That's that's not lying though, that's just being school 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 skilled. <laughs> I was trying to say cool and skilled at the same time. Being very skilled. <laughs> no, that's just being juked. Yeah, getting jebated a little more. You know, that also reminds me of like um Oh, I haven't told you yet. V <gasps> very big nice news. Fucking Johnny. Uh at, at the other Johnny, our Johnny. <laughs> uh, I know from a, a few. from a Radiant server, the uh -huh. one in the one in Friend server. Yeah. He he's sending me his Founders Edition 1060. Oh what? Now it's still a 1060, so it's yeah, not yeah, it's yeah. not an upgrade, and I'm still gonna keep the GPU thing up because you know I would like yeah, an upgrade yeah. that works. But yeah, since it's a Founders Edition. It's it's not gonna be a shitty single fan like my che yeah. like my one, and it will yeah. and obviously it's newer than mine because I think he bought his later than I did, yeah. so it'll work much better. So like while it'll still run the same, I won't have nearly as many of the issues as I as I'm having now. Good. So, huh, fucking good news for once <laughs> in like a year and a half. <laughs> uh, I think he said he already shipped it. Yeah, I got. I know okay. I upgraded it. this year, not the whole year. You know, last year we had some good things. I bought the rest of my computer. So like, yeah, yeah. he sh he's shipped it, and I think he said it'll come in around a month, which because obviously okay. international shipping and whatever. Yeah. But like, God, that I'm a, I'm unnecessarily excited for a 1060 in 2022. <laughs> Like, Listen, just it's... even though it's still a 1060, just finally having a graphics card that fucking works <laughs> is yeah. just gonna be so good. Yeah. Now I just gotta yeah, eventually that's... save up for a good graphics card that works. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's because well, he uh because he he got himself a he got a 3060. 3060 I'm pretty sure. Super? Yeah. 
3060 super yeah because he he told me like yeah it, it will come in a 3060 box don't worry about that okay. <laughs> i i remember him showing a photo of his uh uh, 3060 super mm. and as i and you know he's holding it with one hand and i and i was instantly thinking to myself like oh my god it's starting to set set in on me how big the 3090 is yeah and how fucking blessed you are to be able to get that in the no. first place you lucky bitch I know. you lucky bitch i know <laughs> God, I still... I shouldn't be mad, but God, I'm so jealous. <laughs> like, fuck you. I understand. Like, I even, understand even though, like, you still you still paid for it. Like, yes. it's, not, it's not like I can... Like, I wouldn't be able to get it even if I was in your situation. But, like, God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm on a 3090. Can someone... I hey, the, the, so. twitchtv.com, can some... Can a sugar daddy... <laughs> The, sh the sugar daddy Twitch who's conveniently watching TV. at this moment, can you buy me a 3090, please? Dot Thanks. Dot com dot gov dot uk slash net dot org dot co <laughs> and all the other dots on there are like dot mm. ca yeah dot au <clears throat> Believe me, because I played some Hell at Loose yesterday, mm. um, and it had been uh, months, months since I last played. Like the last time I played Hell at Loose was obviously on my old computer. Yeah. Um, where it ran uh, like shit. <laughs> yes, I was constantly battling between thirty to. You 50 were constantly FPS. battling between the Nazis and your frame rate. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, yes. Hmm. Uh, you know, it was to a point, like, there was, uh, one, like, open field map mm. where, um, I forget the name of the map, but, uh, I was with... I want to get hell out uh, loose at some I, point. When I, if I ever upgrade, is... if I do ever get the chance to upgrade my, my GPU, <laughs> I, I probably it will get it. It is fun. Yeah, it does look fun. It's like Battlefield without the bullshit. Like... Hell Let Loose, I normally do not enjoy those big, open, um, no. military first-person shooter games. I get like, that. Like, you know... I think I, the, last, ga the first... last game like that I enjoyed was Battlefield 4. <laughs> but and even right. then, it's not really, like, huge open. Because at least with a lot of the maps that I liked, there were a lot of, like, tight and, like, confined spaces. <laughs> Yeah. Which were more the, fun because it was just quick, like shoot the shoot action, like di like titty fall is, rip, like which, <laughs> is, which is actually what I liked about like Call of Duty and Modern Warfare and Modern Warfare Two, hmm. um, was that there was you know more like like tight constant spaces. action. Yeah, it's not just like the the main reason I don't fucking like battle royales is because it's bland for like twenty minutes and then a minute of action and then another twenty minutes of waiting. <laughs> well, so I which is say, why, which is why I always is... say fuck EA, fuck Apex Legends, fix Titanfall, <laughs> for fuck's sake. <laughs> it's not that so... I, when you have community dedicated servers having consistently more players than your official servers, because you're so fucking inept that you that you can't use the exact same fix for the hackers that you used on Apex Legends for Titanfall, you can go fuck yourself. And I guarantee it's EA. I guarantee it's not Respawn's fault, it's EA sit telling them that it's not profitable enough to fix Titanfall 2. Because they are built off the exact same engine. It's the same engine, pretty much. Yeah. It is almost the exact same netcode, but they fixed, they fixed Apex Legends within a week and it's been almost a year now and Titanfall 2 is still having hacker problems. You can't join a yeah. server without getting DDoSed offline. I was playing... Uh, Project North Star is the community dedicated servers, by the way. Fucking install it. Yay. It's a godsend if you like Titanfall 2. I was playing that, and there's about like 300 people on all of the community servers. You go on the. I went on the original, the vanilla servers because 
with North Star, it's it's a lot harder to get like frontier defense servers because obviously it's all dedicated, and a dedicated yeah. server for four people isn't really gonna be worth keeping up. Right. And um, guess how many people were playing on the vanilla Titanfall two servers? Ghost oh, never mind. Richter's here. What food you got? He's asking me. He's asking me what I want on my quesadilla. Ooh, or quesadillas. Hmm. Ask Richter as well. How many people does he think was in the, were in the vanilla Titanfall two servers yesterday? How many people do you think were in the vanilla Titanfall two servers yesterday? Keep right, and then continue straight. He's thinking. Mm-hmm. Still very popular. Go straight. People like to play the original alongside with the uh, second one. Keep the hackers in mind. And we're not counting the, the dedicated community servers from North Star. We're That's not, about that was about three hundred yesterday. <laughs> we're not counting the community servers. We're counting left, just the vanilla servers. Continue straight. Some number in the triple digits. Go straight. <laughs> Nine. Nine? <laughs> Nine people <laughs> were playing Titanfall 2 yesterday in the vanilla servers. And on North Star, they were. Oh, they, it was. <laughs> oh, this guy had some. This guy was having some troubles. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's genuinely upsetting. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you know, it, it probably. I is mean, I'm gl I'm glad the community server servers were alive. Like, obviously, 300 yeah. people in community servers for a dead game. That's not too bad. <laughs> no. But I want the game to not be dead. <laughs> yeah. Well, I um. <sighs> yeah, I I, I, w I wouldn't doubt if it was nine hackers. Hmm. They're all just there waiting for just a regular person to jump in so and go, ooh, 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 and mm. just, you know. That's not, I doubt it, because the hack, it's not like right. cheating hackers, it's like they're all DDoSers. So I don't think they have yeah. to be like in the game to DDoS oh, the servers. Yeah. Sucks. Hmm. I mean, they might do, I don't know. <laughs> if you're that type of person who literally just finds joy in just ruining people's fun like that. Hmm. The world genuinely is a better place without you. Yeah, that is the one. That is honestly, I, I will be spicy. That is the one time that I agree with low tier god. <laughs> you should kill yourself now. Now. <laughs> like, if you gain pleasure in fucking ruining the experience of people, for what? Yeah. For, for literally what reason? I don't know. What do they gain out of this? Nothing. Yeah, like, y you are below dirt. Like, <laughs> yeah. you don't deserve to breathe. Yeah. Fucking delete yourself and your shitty fucking software DDoSing the servers as well. <laughs> Take yeah. it into the ground with you. <laughs> I want the D- if, if this issue ever gets fixed, I want the- I want all of the DDoSers to get doxxed. I'm genuinely- I am genuinely saying that. <laughs> I want them to you be know, doxxed. <laughs> like, they deserve it. <laughs> that reminds me as well, like, the one, of the- one of the big, like, Switch hackers, um, not like the malicious kind, but basically mm. one of the Switch hackers are like, hey, play Switch games for free. Hey, um, like homebrew guys. Yeah, well they, uh, they got hit by, you know, Nintendo's very powerful oh, legal team. Mm. Um, Oh, this is just on the topic of like hackers. Um, yeah. And uh, they got hit with like a ungodly sum of money that they'll never be able to pay off. Mm. Um, as well as uh, 40 months in prison. Mm. Jesus. And well, yeah, it's it's Nintendo. Like that's mm. them, and they they put it out on their official Twitter stating the guy's name. What? Like that's when you can tell. They're making an example out of them. Hmm. And it's not going to change anything. <laughs> no, all it's going to do is aren't, just people aren't people... going to people are going to keep partying your games and 
downloading your music if you're a shitty company. <laughs> They're going to keep doing it. They're just going to be more quiet about it. People aren't doing this because they don't like you as a company. Well, they are. People aren't doing it because they want to steal money from you. They're doing it because you're not fucking doing it yourselves. <laughs> like, if you don't want people to emulate your games, sell your fucking games. So, yeah, that's the, <laughs> it's that's not the that. It's not that hard. It's the same with the music. Well, like, yeah. they're so against people, like, s down, like, in, like, listening to their old music, then fucking sell it. Then <laughs> fucking, like, it, holy it shit. Spotify. Not even Spotify, just have an official YouTube channel. The, yeah. Like, in, instead of giving G Jeeva Sunna 2,000 DMCAs, just upload the music yourself. <laughs> just do it, like, come on. Wait, how do you pronounce it? Jivasana, because it's Jilva, it's like, it looks like Jilvasana, but the L is a capital I, so I say Jivasana. Same, same wait, as Siva Gunna. I... Siva Gunna and Jivasana was... are separate accounts. No, 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 I thought it was Giva. It might be, Giva, I don't know, I guess that would make sense with Siva Gunna. I kind of, I kind of flip-flop between the two, same with Gif and Jif. It was like, I know one of them's right, but fuck it, you know? Whatever, whatever my mind says when I'm, in, when I'm talking. But like, yeah. Instead of just deleting his fucking existence off the face of the internet, do it your fucking self. <laughs> like, I know, and come on. Well, so, the, okay, here's the thing about the Giva, Jiva Sunner situation. Mm. Um, so as it turned out, people <laughs> investigated that wasn't Nintendo. It wasn't Nintendo, no. I know that. That was... Yeah, that was... Because um, Nintendo's... Like, when they DMCA things, it's, like, a much more accurate name than just Nintendo JP. Like... Yeah. <laughs> they will usually do, like, Nintendo of Japan, or, like... It, with Well, with Nintendo yeah. of Japan, they, you know, they use Japanese. <laughs> yeah, and... Hello, uh, train. Or uh, Nintendo of America. Yeah. Like, it's not just Nintendo... So, uh, yeah, that's why it's like that. It, just it means just... that just means uh, again going on to like the people who do this shit for like seemingly no reason. For yeah. the, the random fucko who decided to pose as, as Nintendo and just re and just like completely obliterate this channel f for no reason. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, it's like goddamn, you are scummy. <laughs> It really is just like, are you 14 years old? Lamar. Do do your parents not love you? Mm, yeah. The, could fucking uh, what's the word? Fatherless behavior XD. I couldn't think of it. <laughs> well, because that actually reminds me. I was watching. I was watching a hungry box video uh, right before the stream. Uh, that just called. Uh, so you entered a Smash Brothers tourney. Oh um, no. And uh, <laughs> the. Uh, the like second person that he fights, they're playing as Mr. Game and Watch, um, mm. and like you know they're they're lagging. Uh, so one of the big rules about <clears throat> online tournaments in Smash is that you have to be using an Ethernet cable. Mm. You just have to be and using. An not, Ethernet not even cable. not even just an Ethernet cable. You need good internet. Like yeah, you, you can like you can have Wi-Fi that is like a great connection. That's like yeah. better than Ethernet, but like you just need a you sh need a good connection for like fighting games and games like that. Yeah. Like if 100%. it's a if it's fucking Mario Kart and shit like that, who cares if you have a yeah. bad connection? Like it it's pretty much the same. Yeah. But in stuff like that that requires like precise timing and like yeah really specific movements like you need to be able to see what the fuck is going on yeah exactly um so they were uh you know they uh, this second person was very clearly lagging so mm. um something you can do in an online smash journey is um if it feels like they are lagging and it's not it's definitely not your fault you can ask for a moderator and be like hey i need to do a lag test Mm. 
where um, basically uh, mod rare they just have like a little program or something where they can uh, they can uh, essentially check the rates. Essentially, uh, yeah, just players. like a ping check. Yeah. And uh, yeah, um, <laughs> Hungrybox uh, requests for a lag uh, a lag test, and this uh, second this you know this other player was immediately getting salty um, <laughs> about it. And like, uh, just basically being a total dick about it. Mm. Um, and like, <laughs> at one point, one of the other one of the moderators for the tournament was like, "Bro, use English, please." Um, because you know they were, they were essentially typing like a child. Which, funny enough, um, they tried to make their case saying like, you know, that they were fine because they have this thing called a mocha adapter, which. You know, making again, making their case like mm, it, I can with this, I can play, I can play on Wi-Fi, but it's like I'm playing on Ethernet. And it's like what? Oh, so like no? a TP link, but even TP links are better than that. <laughs> it, it, it was weird, and uh, again, there was like, what exactly are you? We don't understand what it is that you're playing on. Hungrybox did look it up, and he's like, what the hell is this? Yeah, and say, like, we don't understand what that is, and clearly it's not working. And <laughs> yeah. Um, and, uh, again, they're, like, trying to just get a straightforward answer out of him, and he finally, s and he just finally says, bro, IDK, my dad set it up for me. Mm. Which, you know, there's an immediate red flag. XD, the kids were pro kid was probably, like, 15. <laughs> Close. Um, they then, like, later said, uh, they basically tried to guilt trip, just being like, uh, uh, I, ha I hate to, pull, uh, pull this out on you, but I, uh, fucked up my geometry, my geometry test today. Maybe you, should, maybe you shouldn't said, have been playing Smash. <laughs> maybe you shouldn't have been, you know, just wasting your time trying to get a hit tweet on Twitter. Mm. Maybe you should have been, like, I don't know, paying attention in school. Hmm. Um, Shit, like, it's not they, that hard to yeah, do they, those they tests. Like, I, said, bro, I, I'm 14. Oh my god, I was almost on point. I was almost yeah, on, on point. point. <laughs> and that's when the hungry box just starts laughing. <laughs> it's just... Uh, cause it's, Bruh, it's just you're not even, like, kid. in... You're not even, like, in finals yet. Failing your test doesn't mean shit. <laughs> 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 just wait until the next one. <laughs> All, fa yeah, all failing your tests in, like, the middle of school means is just that you're going to be in a different class for the next, like, section. Like, it doesn't mean shit. <laughs> so I, uh, like, looking at the way they're reacting and them saying, I'm, uh, bro, I'm 14, it just solidified to me that, um, right. to be 100% honest with you, mm -hmm. like, some could say this as, uh, old woman, uh, complaining about darn kids these days, but no, 100% honest. Like, not all of them, but essentially, um, kids who are terminally online, oh, they're getting fucking worse. Mm-hmm. No, 100%. But, um, I'm not, again, it's the not internet is The I'm internet is becoming inter I'm more saying, accessible, like, and, like, people who don't know how to control themselves... Yeah. Are like, like staying on it constantly at a young age, and it's just yeah. plaguing their mind with stupid bullshit that they don't need. No. Hello. 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 I thought my internet died for a second. You stopped making noise. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I um, I. I was munching my water. Drinking, you slurping. Keep left. Mm. Uh what the hell was I saying? Yeah, um It's specifically internet kids, because you know, again, like mm. I sort of was an internet kid. I mm. like I mean I will I even admit I am I would consider myself terminally online. <laughs> like I, yeah. My my life is literally based on the internet. My job 
is this always on the internet? Yeah. I don't have yeah. any IRL friends. <laughs> like, yeah. I, I am, by definition, terminally online. <laughs> But I'm yeah. not shit, and like I, I know my limits. I can control, like what yeah. I think and like what I do. Unlike some yeah. of these people, who are usually between thirteen and seventeen, who just don't understand common sense, well, and just well, think that everything sense. revolves around them because they got two likes on their tweet. <laughs> not, not only do they not understand common sense. But Restraint. it's just um, <laughs> clout chasing is becoming a bigger problem. Mm -hmm. Where like you know, and for the most part, it's not most influencers' faults. No, um, it's uh, it's just the fact that they're you know this is what they're unfortunately being raised by, and a lot of parents are just not able to keep up with their kid. Yeah. So uh, they see what their shithead high school friends are doing on TikTok. <laughs> Mm. And there was like, I gotta do that. God, I TikTok. Know, uh, you know what? Know. TikTok is the reason. I don't, TikTok and Vine are probably the reason that so much more kids nowadays are fucking stupid. <laughs> Yeah. Like, Vine wasn't as bad because it was mostly just adults doing stupid shit. But with TikTok becoming, I guess, more accessible. So many yeah, more TikTok like TikTok is more easily accessible than Vine was. So much more like teenagers are just doing stupid fucking shit. And because of algorithm.png, they're getting popular for it. And other and people are seeing understand. that and are doing the same thing because they fucking thirst for for popularity. No, <laughs> it's just it's it can be it can be said that um that the strangest part about it is that uh, we as people have not actually changed. Like, we've always been doing the stupid stuff we do. Mm. We're just hyper aware of it now. Yeah. And that's why uh, a lot of us say, like, oh, we didn't used to do this. No, no, no. We actually did used to do this stupid shit. We did. We just realized it's fucking stupid now. <laughs> <laughs> we yeah, and we also just uh, realized pretty quickly it was stupid. Mm. And I don't know. Uh, this is also gonna be a bit of a spicy take, but I think I think schools should be allowed again to just go back to being able to just <laughs> hit the child. Hmm. Just. Let's get all Catholic up in here and just be like, ah, oh, you fucking idiots. I'm gonna get the ruler out. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but ru ass. ruler time. <laughs> Cause like, I don't know, it's it's weird to say, but I'm like, man, I feel like I feel like more kids these days need to be hit. Man, at this point, just take away their phones and they'll fucking scream. Like the <laughs> Oh yeah, one hundred percent. Like, honestly, why pe people, it's... like, parents shouldn't be giving their kids so much access to the internet at such an early age. No, like, no. I, I, will, I will gladly say it. Parents who give their, like, six-year-old kids tablets, you're a bad parent. Yeah. Like, just, just flat out, you are a horrible parent. You are ruining your child. Yeah. If you want your kid to have fun, buy them toys. Make them go out. Well, eh, maybe don't make them go outside nowadays. Make them do things. Don't make them sit in front of a screen and watch, and watch babies' first colors on fucking YouTube Kids. Like that's gonna fuck them up mentally. <laughs> I worry for my nephew. Because, I will. You know what? Uh, I will also make another quick. Um, sp I, I guess spicy take. Kids fucking ruined fi Friday Night Funkin'. Yeah. Like, the holy shit, the community for Friday Night Funkin' is actually cancerous now. Like the amount of the amount of mods and shit that I see come up that are like made by a thirteen year old that become, becomes massively popular, and then that kid's mind is just ruined because of it. 
and yeah. then they get into some sort of drama or they do something stupid and like it it's stupid like kids no shouldn't kids shouldn't be allowed on the internet at that young of an age i genuinely believe you you shouldn't be allowed internet access until you're like 15 or 16 like See, at all. E and even then it should be limited until you're 18 I can't really comment because I was, uh, not actively, but I was using the internet. I know, like... I, I mean, like, nowadays. Like, befo okay, that's fair. before, I, I had internet access when I was, like, eight. I, pl I played, like, fucking RuneScape and World of Warcraft and all that shit yeah, when, I, when, I was, like, I was... when I was, like, fucking crawling across the floor. <laughs> yeah, I was, like, 10 but, like, 11. the internet nowadays, you, people, like, kids shouldn't be allowed on it. It's too much easy access to just mind-numbing, like, shit that will ruin their lives. <laughs> yeah. And now it's... I have dinner. Ooh! Ooh. Ooh. Thank you. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I love you. Hi, Nobis. B bonjour. B bonjour. <laughs> B <laughs> Peepees. Yeah, it's a. Uh, Let me go to my other It's a. It's definitely a discussion. Mm. That's the only way I can put it. It is a discussion. It's a problem. <laughs> yeah, I. I personally think that like, maybe not fifteen, but I think that um. Maybe thirteen is when we can allow um, a modern child to have internet access. Hmm. Um, but again, limited. Yeah. Very limited. Like, heavily monitored. But that's just my personal opinion. Yeah. They can argue uh, all they want about privacy, but, um, yeah, no, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> That's a part of parenting. Hmm. We give you, excuse me. We give you privacy when you when we think you've earned it. I think that's a fair way to look at it. Yeah. Oh, and I need to if we can tell you definitely haven't earned it, well, you're not getting privacy. Hmm. Uh, but I don't know. I I'm gonna I'm gonna quickly pivot to something completely different. It was one of the things I was thinking about on my way home from work. Um, I don't remember what led up to me thinking about it, but it was like it was thinking about uh you know I think it was born out of the idea of like. Oh, in another lifetime, maybe things could have been like this, uh, or something or other. Which made me think about, um, the expression of cats having nine lives. Hmm. And I, and I thought to myself, if you had nine lives, how would it work? Hmm. And with that, what, what would you do? Like, what would you do if you had those nine lives? Like... I don't know, man. <laughs> like, I was thinking to myself, like, oh, does it work, like, um, <clears throat> let's say you were, like, critically injured, you know, we'll just say fatally wounded, mm. you were going to die, but then suddenly just, uh, you know, you have this out-of-body experience and Zavaldo happens or, excuse <laughs> me, or something, and, uh, when, when that takes place, you're basically given a chance to basically, you, you go back in time you see a version a projection of yourself um at a point in time where you can be like oh okay so that's what led to this moment i'm gonna <laughs> quickly i'm just gonna quickly jump to this point so that i can make this decision and there we go now i have uh eight more chances at this hmm. but if you say um, pass on from old age, does that cancel it out? Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, that's a and, tough uh, thing to think uh, of. It's a. It's a. It was a weird 
what I was thinking about. Hmm. Like, and of course, me being me, I was like, and with that, is it also like Binding of Isaac? You have nine lives, but <laughs> you have one HP. Mm -hmm. So, you're just like, <laughs> Chew, I sneeze too hard. <laughs> just... <laughs> yeah, that's how and it then works. You just, come, you just come back and you're like, oh, damn it, now I've got seven lives. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, man. Uh, wait, no, I should upgrade the trucks of, like, the people who have high rank. <laughs> you. Your truck needs to be upgraded because you're actually good at driving. I also thought about it, like, um, oh, do you, uh... Oh, this is already upgraded. I think you, this is just my watch... old truck. Yeah, it is. <laughs> do you watch a moment of yourself? Because, you know, they also say, like, you know, my, my whole life flashed before my eyes. Do you watch... Just like Do you instant watch replay. Your... <laughs> yeah, and again, like, um, you find that point in time mm. of uh we can correct a mistake. Uh but maybe it is while you were a teenager, and um then when that when that happens, do you continue just living life as a teenager, or do you like immediately jump back to the present where with like all of the differences up to then having already happened? Also, stream died. I think it... Is everyone else... I mean, I guess Anubis is the only other one here, Lamau. But, like, is it dying yeah. for you as well? It might just be an issue with you, Defunk. Because I'm not getting any, like, issues popping up on OBS. Like, it'll say when I've dropped frame frames or, like, if my, if my um, upload rate is stunted. But it hasn't been saying anything. I don't know if it is just me. I know yesterday I saw a, um... I saw a pop-up for an NVIDIA driver update. Mm, yeah, I, I got that before that. stream as well, but I haven't upgraded it, obviously. Yeah. I wonder if it's just that. But I don't know. I it it was it was weird thinking about it. I only thought about it for a few minutes, but um, it was just neat concept of like you know what would you even do if you had nine lives like a cat. God, this color is gross. It's, it's, it's pure green. green. Make it. Mm. Somewhere there. I also wondered, like, is uh, is nine lives more like reincarnation? I would think of it like that, honestly. Like you just yeah. kind of reset and live a different life. Or like now, honestly, the of a or like honestly, uh, the one time in my entire life I have talked about something while it's still relevant. Sifu does a decent does a decent oh, job. Yeah. At, does like kind of a decent job of working about that. Where like it kind of you have like you every time you die, you kind of like add time to your life like you'll get you back get older. you'll get back up straight away but you'll be yeah. like a year older <laughs> yeah yeah like i kind of like that I believe idea it's of it when you reach 70 that's when you're just dead dead if you if you go past 70 then yeah like if you i think it's you can go past 70 if uh -huh. you're like if you're going up like from below 70 <laughs> But mm. once you're above 70, if you die again, then it's over. It's okay. over. <laughs> Sifu, I think, is, like, very interesting concept for a game. Hmm. Because, uh, the idea of, yeah, when you die, you just, um, you just grow a year older. Hmm. That's something I hadn't seen done before. Yeah. And also the fact that it happens to apparently be a really hard game. Hmm. So basically, Damn, this person is driven like more it. than I have. I no, I've been I've been watching people play it. It looks fun. It doesn't look like bullshit hard, which mm. are the games that I don't like. It looks like yeah. it's fun hard, <laughs> which is why like I'm kind of indifferent on games like Dark Souls because like. It's kind of a mix of bullshit hard and fun hard. Like, yeah, you do. You you will figure out how to 
overcome the hard and like figure out how to beat it but the yeah. process of doing that in the first pa place is the part that i'm not a fan of yeah like i will i will say like fucking amazingly designed game <laughs> yeah it's what it's why i like bloodborne i love that game i sucked at it but i loved it <laughs> yeah like, well, Bloodborne's yeah. the only one I played too. Yeah, same. <laughs> I think I've only, I've played Bloodborne and uh, three. I think Dark Souls. Actually, well, I know I played like the very, 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 very beginning of the first Dark Souls, mm. and I was like, ah, neat. And uh, I also played the again very, very beginning of Dark Souls two. I was like, ah, neat. And um, I didn't actually finish Bloodborne, but I was like, I like this one. I like how this one feels. Yeah. That's the best way I can describe it. There's just something about how Bloodborne feels, where it's like, oh, if this was just on an on a on a good PC, oh, this would be buttery smooth. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Wait, I have an extra slot. I should recruit another driver. Does anyone have the, a um, decent rating? You have PS1, PS1 D make of uh, Bloodborne. Mm. Which I still think is really cool and I still love haven't gotten it. Still there. haven't gotten around to playing it, but I might at some point. I'd watch that. I'd watch you play that. Two slots. Hello. I just think it's cool that someone put in all that effort to make a Bloodborne fan game. Hmm. And specifically one that is like PS1 styled. Yeah. It's very interesting seeing all these uh, indie developers. They're like, yeah, these are the games I grew up with, so I wanna, I wanna replicate this style. Oh yeah, sure. I don't know. I just think it's very neat. Hmm. That is not a truck. <laughs> You're not a truck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's give them good trucks. Sure. She's not a truck. Let's buy two of these. And the fat fucking wheels. Shit, actually this looks like it'll be better than my truck. <laughs> have you ever had have you ever like actually had a Valentine for Valentine's Day? No. <laughs> Understandable. Actually maybe. I used to be the type. Depen depends on where. Get... Depends on what time the last one's uh, finished. We'll say. <laughs> I see. Hmm. I used to be the type who would get very bitter and cynical on Valentine's Day. Hmm. Guess why? Um. I no, don't I don't want to drive my new truck. Stop. Obviously, just... being in this, uh, being with Richter, I'm just like, oh, you know what? Yeah. Valentine's Day. It's a little lover's day. I don't mind it hmm. so much anymore. I wonder why. Hmm. Let's give this one, like, a gross color. I will say, like, <laughs> on Twitter yesterday, I was getting a little tired of seeing all the people that are like, haha, I'm lonely on Valentine's Day. Who can relate? Haha, la -ha, There we go. Like, yeah, I, I... Neon green, baby. Is that that... And it got to a point where I was kind of rolling my eyes, like, okay, yeah, I get it, I've seen this before. Like, some of us actually do want to be happy today. Mm. Mm. Like, I genuinely was seeing more of the cynical takes mm. than um, people just wanting to spread a little love. Yeah. Which is why I'm... <clears throat> Excuse me. Like, I'll I'll be you know what I'll be cynical and I'll and I'll spread love. I may I may be fucking lonely on Valentine's Day, but if you're also lonely for Valentine's Day, I'm here. <laughs> I'll I'll, well, I'll be I'll like, be your girlfriend for Valentine's Day. <laughs> that's what um that's like the post I was making on Twitter yesterday. I was like, look, if you don't have anyone, I've got a big heart. I'm more willing to e let you even if I've Valentine's even day. if I've never met you. If someone asks if you've had a val if you had a Valentine's Day, point them at my dumb fucking face and say, "Yeah, that bitch, that, <laughs> that bitch gave me a fat box of chocolates and I loved it." And I. <laughs> <laughs> 
didn't even just point at me and say, yeah, that panda right there. It was nice. It was nice. He said nice things to me. Yes. And I did. I wanted to say a bunch of nice things to people yesterday. Hmm, can I in my garage? Here I am. Give me Twayla. Because I had a good day. Hmm. It was a good Monday. I didn't, but I'm not going to let that stop me. <laughs> mm. That's just because I'm fucking sick as hell. Mm -hmm. Does a kickflip. Does... <laughs> Does... <laughs> God, I'm stupid. Does a kickflip, fails and fucking scrapes my face across the concrete. <laughs> I mean, shit, I used With to, a... I, you know what, I, I used to be semi-decent at skateboarding, and then that's, that's another thing I just stopped doing. <laughs> hmm. But that was, le that was less for, like, mental reasons and more for physical reasons, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, literally that. not being able to. <laughs> yeah. I, um, <laughs> I was in my thing, just like, your little Bennett character <clears throat> doing a kick clip, failing immediately, and just again scraping across mm. the road, <laughs> yeah. just face down, and then with a with a heart that just shows up with an arrow going through, and it says "Happy Valentine's Day." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Turn left. You're special. Hey, get get that get that fake fucking GPS out of my screen. Get out of here. This is a simulation. <laughs> Ignore the mirror. <laughs> I need that. Don't. Oh god, I have to re get used to the longer trailer now. You see, in the simulation, you have to be immersed. So we pick Shao the Hedgehog as our guide. Yeah. Like, if I was playing. When I, like, am able to play this in VR for streams, I'll do it every yeah. time. That'll be fun. I don't think yeah. I can play online with the VR, like, update, but mm -hmm. it'll be fun. I think so. I think it'll because be Because cool. it'll, it'll also mean I can be more immersed in the simulation because I won't have to have the fake mirror and I can just look to the left to check my mirror yeah. and, like, look out the window and shit. And then also, I eventually want to get, like, a race wheel to mm -hmm. use, which, even more simulator. Which means I will essentially have to learn how to drive, because I, I don't know, I don't, I'm not good with the clutch. I just... <laughs> Hello, DK. Get... I'm imagining... I'm imagining your Fennec character, just like the one South Park meme where Stan just, like, um, he's backing up. It looks like he's just giving you that face of what the fuck. <laughs> I'm having your fanic just like doing that, just like mm. backing up within a virtual truck. <laughs> just like, what the fuck did you just say to me? Hmm. Am I, I in that guy's way? In my oh, head no. Like that. Uh, no, I don't think I am. That's what makes me laugh. Hmm. Damn, where's Feline to draw this dumb shit? <laughs> I don't know. Just ask him. I don't know. That's, it. That's, that's he's doing too much stuff, probably. Was he? He's also on Do Not Disturb, so you. Yeah. Uh, okay. I. I think I'm. Not, I'm pretty sure I've asked this before. Could you see yourself as a truck driver? No, I don't have the patience. <laughs> Yeah, well, you know what? Not even, I do have the patience. I don't have the energy. Mm. Like I could, I could gladly like drive a truck for like ten hours straight to make a delivery, but I yeah. would, I would pass out halfway, halfway through. Yeah. Like <laughs> I wouldn't be able to stay up for that long, which is surprising, yeah. seeing as I sometimes go like days straight without sleeping. But you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Well, it's like, <clears throat> it takes different kinds of energy, like, yeah. being able to make that drive and knowing that you're carrying a lot of cargo, it does take some mental energy. Yeah, like, I'd be able to stay up for it, but I don't think I could drive for that long. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Also, the fact that I wouldn't really be able to, like, do much, like, the reason I can stay up so late usually 
on my computer it's because i have like you guys to talk to and i have things to do if i'm driving yeah. a truck for 10 hours i'm driving a truck for 10 hours i'm not doing anything yeah. else <laughs> like unless yeah. you unless you were there with me in the passenger yeah. seat like <laughs> One, I would have someone to talk to for the time, and that would keep me happy and alive. Two, we can take turns. Yeah. If I'm getting too tired, we can switch seats. Like how when I was uh, driving from Pennsylvania to Colorado, and uh, Richter and I in the moving uh, in the moving truck or moving mm. van. No, yeah, it was a truck. Um, we, uh, you know, we took turns. Hmm. There are times when <clears throat> when he got too tired, and so I would take over, and uh, well, lo and behold, we obviously got here safely. Yeah. I'm glad you did. And I will still, we will still never forget that woman at that one steak and shake in like Illinois or wherever. <laughs> um, <clears throat> maybe it was Idaho. I don't know. Um. No, not Idaho. What am I saying? Idaho. Anyway, um... I don't know. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. that's okay. I... Yeah, that, that woman was a gem. Um, mm. if you ever just ask Richter about, um, traveling from Pennsylvania to Colorado and mention the steak and shake, he will... He will delightfully tell you that story. <laughs> nice. Because that woman was an absolute godsend, and mm. we will never forget her. Good... It's great running especially, into nice people every once in a while. No, especially because, like, she had been up all night the night before. Oof. Right. So, like, you know, right. she was basically pulling a double, maybe even a triple. Yeah. Because, um, <laughs> but to her, she was still happily awake, and, you know, she was, uh, it's like I mentioned before, when we got there, um, and I, and I said, like, you know, I'd just, uh, like to have some coffee, and she was like, I knew there was a reason I brewed a fresh pot, and I was like... Oh my god, yes. <laughs> it's like the perfect timing. Um, and the reason why she had been there the whole night was because the day before, it was a bunch of graduation parties. Uh. So, um, she shows that she has like literally hundreds, hundreds of dollars in tips. Nice. Has, so yeah, she was just, she was making <laughs> bank <laughs> that night, that's why she, that's oh, why yeah. it wasn't bothering her. Yeah. Like you are, and you know you are an actual boss. As a as a phenomenal manager for a steak and shake, <laughs> just a phenomenal manager in general. Yeah. You don't see, especially in the food service industry, you don't see that many wonderful managers. You don't see people who care enough like that. Yeah. <laughs> like I get it. Food industry, it's it's tough. Mm. Just like retail, it's tough. You had to have a certain mindset for it. Yeah. A mindset that I definitely don't have anymore. I have patience. Not for stupid people. Yeah, I, I'm the same with that. I do have a lot of patience. But if you're a piece of shit, or you're annoying and stupid, that patience will wear thin very quickly. Yes. <laughs> I lost a bunch of my for stupid people. I lost a bunch of my uh, patience just at my first job alone. Oh, dealing there's with the pink again. I don't people. know if you can see that now. <laughs> what am I looking for? Hmm. What am I looking for? They're like on these stone, these little stone walls. They uh -huh. have they have like a pink tint on them. When if I'm kind of far away. No, I don't see it. Huh. I don't know why that's not showing up on stream, because that is 100%, like, I'm not going crazy. It's 100% there on my screen. You can <laughs> just take a screenshot and show it. I don't know if it would show up in the screenshot now that you're saying that. <laughs> uh, I think it would, probably. Mm -hmm. But then why isn't it showing up on stream? Um, hmm, a conundrum. Yeah. I mean, I could take a I'm picture on my phone. And then... <laughs> See, that'd be definitive proof that it isn't doctored. Hmm. Yeah, for Lamel. You Hold imagine. On. I'm doing. I'm doing the. Way. I'm doing the cardinal sin. I'm pulling my phone out while driving. <laughs> 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 I 
Imagine uh, a professional doctor doctoring some kind of um, some kind of like photo or evidence. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they're like, <laughs> um, they provide some kind of like fake evidence in a court of law. They're like, no, no, it's okay. I'm a doctor. I'm allowed to do this. <laughs> You're like what? No, that's that's not how this works. Like, it's called this, doctoring, isn't this it? This photo is doctored. What, what, yes, that's I, yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a doctor. That's what I do. I took I'm the a photo. I do. <laughs> Have another terrible <clears throat> thought. Do it. Say it. doctor when he a doctor having sex about to climax and he's shouting oh get doctored <laughs> I know I know stupid <laughs> it's great though <laughs> the doctor what's going on here oh you, you know huh? Ooh, we're just doing some doctoring <laughs> What, are they fucking, like, You're... in the fucking room? Like, in one of the surgery rooms? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's it's mid-surgery on, like, this woman's arm. <laughs> it's just like, well, I couldn't hold it in! And the uh, woman's like, oh, you couldn't hold it in! My arm's in pain! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> She's still uh... conscious during the surgery, <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> the doctor's just like, I'm not gonna have sex with an unconscious body. It's gross. It's like having sex with a dead person. Oh no. You think I am necrophiliac? Ugh! I'm a doctor. This is the turn we've taken. <laughs> While I eat dinner. I'm not apologizing to anyone. Don't. <laughs> No, I, you're right. I want to apologize to anyone for my right. terrible humor. Right. Yeah, our terrible humor is great. Is that like a Nazi right. moron? Hmm? Our terrible humor is great. Don't, Don't worry about it. Keep and just like the doctor having sex with that patient. I'm we not have, we have, it. we have the best terrible humor. I mean, on a scale of 1 through 10, I'd like to think our terrible humor is at an 8. Mm, I can... I, I can give it an 8. On a good an day, a 9. On, oh. on, a, on a good day. On our best days, yeah, it's an 11. Oh, it's a fucking 20. It's, <laughs> oh, look at those guys. Yeah! Not yeah! Really. Quickly wash my hands. Yeah! Okay. All three of them. Let's go. Ugh. Oh, God. This coffee is not hitting me quick enough. <laughs> also gone cold. Gross. I still need to do the fucking bingo board for these streams. <laughs> I've never gotten around to- How many people are delivering these fucking beam things? These like yellow beams. Is this per- No, this person has an, has an actual trailer. The fuck? They have like a triple trailer. I want that. That's gotta be like a DLC thing. Because I have like none of the DLCs. The DLCs in this game are like fucking $2,000. <laughs> so much shit. <laughs> Hmm. My goodness. Uh, bah, 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 bah. 
anyway, now that I've <clears throat> finished dinner. Mm. Now that you've finished munching. Doing the crunch munch. Mm, the crunchy munchy. I forgot what I was talking about. I know we were talking about doctoring and making puns out of it. I don't <laughs> remember. We were talking about funny. Um, and while you and were gone, also, I was talking about how I need to fucking do the bingo board for these streams at some point because I keep on not doing it. Yeah. Uh, you'll you'll manage at some point. Well, mm. You'll just finally be like, oh yeah, I should do that. Yeah. And then <clears throat> it's gonna be very low effort in like the most hilarious way. Hmm. I mean, no, it's, it's just gonna be like, like a square. Like if I'm not gonna bother making it look fancy. <laughs> it's just gonna be tic tac toe. <laughs> Keep left. Not even a bingo board, just a tic tac toe board. No, nah, it's it's gotta it's gotta be five by five. I can't be cheap. <laughs> also, a little message from Cream, just uh, her saying hi. Ah. And, you know, that's that's all. She's supposed to give a hi. Ooh. Well, I say <clears throat> hello back. I will. Beautiful bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you and Cream were my Valentine yesterday. <laughs> I'll happily accept that. Yeah. You you two were my 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 gay bitches. My, <laughs> my lovely lesbian ladies. <laughs> Excuse me. Even though, even though we're both bi, we are, we are here lesbian ladies. Mm, yeah, I'm the only lesbian here. <laughs> but it's good enough for me. <laughs> so, I, I do have to ask real quick, like, um, why did you pick Freya from Animal Crossing as your profile pick? Because she's my favorite villager. That's fair enough. Hmm. And it's kind of, it's me and Cream kind of doing like the themed profile pictures. Like before it was her as Roxy and me as Chica. Now it's her as Isabel oh. and me as Freya. <laughs> so that's what's going on. Okay. Yeah. You should join in. Pick a villager. Pinky. Do it. I could. Yeah. I just have to get a. <laughs> My brain sucks. From from a website dot dot net <laughs> website dot net <clears throat> I mean I already found a good PNG mm. assuming it's a PNG I hope it's a PNG it's a PNG nice yeah I can at least um I can at least set it up as like the uh, profile pick on this Discord. Mm, no, it's uh, gotta be global. You can't cheat like that. It's gotta be global. Okay. <laughs> can't flex your Nitro subscription on me. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> I mean. I could. Flexing your wasted money on me. If. <laughs> <laughs> I will still gladly say Nitro is a fucking waste of money. <laughs> I, I know I, I know that's just coming from a broke bitch, but I will gladly say it. Oh, there it is again. No, I can't pull my phone out quick enough. No. <laughs> now my question is, does it show? Well, I'm assuming it would show up on stream. Oh my god. Chill! Chill. <laughs> Bruh! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Colorado driver. Lamel. Wait, hold on. Not, There's like, more on this. I can see if I can get it here. <laughs> like, I know... I know that you don't drive, but, like, what's honestly been, like, the worst road situation you've ever been in? Uh... God, I don't know. 
We have a lot of shit drivers in London. Yeah, I can believe that. Mm. And he stopped at the light anyway. <laughs> I'm going to try something. Aww. Oh, there it is. I see, I see the face. It's not there on the stream though. Oh no. Uh, if I reset like the source, it will probably work. So I'll do that after this delivery. I'm right here. All right. Get ready to turn right. Yeah. Turn right. I see. I see, said the blind man to his deaf wife as they watched over turn their mute right. children. Yep. What yep. you said. It's all over now. Wait, how did he go th I'm... We weren't in a no collision zone. How did he just go right through me? Fuck. Have you, have you never heard, uh, I see, said the blind man? Yeah, I've heard that. I see, said the blind man to his deaf friend is usually what I see. Or what I've read, at least remember. Yeah. Oh no. Okay, good. Yeah, the Crisis first of I it. Remember is, yeah, um, the blind man talking to his deaf wife as they watched over their mute children. The. <laughs> Meetings, like. No one can see or hear each other. Mm. Boy. So I, um... Now... Where is it? Which one is it? It's this one, I think. Refresh. Nope, not working. This is so sad. No. I don't know. I... See, now you got me thinking. I, I might I might actually change my uh, global avatar to Pinky from Animal Crossing just because. Good. That's what you were supposed to do in the first place. <laughs> not allowed to cheat like, out. Not allowed to... <laughs> I know you're making fun of me for Nitro, but I still I will. Did it. I don't I don't care, you do it globally. <laughs> don't be a pussy. <laughs> you pussy bitch. Don't be a baby. I have to like go to a bunch of Discord servers, just keep changing my <laughs> surfer profile pic. No. Just make it at all. Who cares? Get on with it. I don't know. I just think it's funny. Hmm. You gotta do it in the normal profile picture. Not the not the 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 scam of, of Nitro's per server profile pictures. <laughs> Honestly, I don't get the per server server profile pictures anyway. Like, I don't, I don't get um, the appeal. Like, it's just more work. I, no, I actually do. Um, to bring up, uh, uh, Barry, um, for all the, like, discords that they're on for, uh, any of their normie friends, um, their <clears throat> global avatar, it's like, it's like this green pixelated face. Yeah. Um, it's cute to look at. Um, but, um, so like... Bit. On some discords, um, they have their persona as their profile pic, hmm. so that you know they can, so that they can be a furry, without anyone, uh, any normie person being like, "Hey, what's with that profile pic?" Hmm. I would, I just don't care about people's perception on me. I guess if people know I'm a furry, fucking lamau. Yeah. <laughs> Good for them. What are you gonna do when you? I'm kind of the same way. I'm just like, look, if you, if you cry, know, cry okay, cool. about it. <laughs> cry about a duck gif. Mm. Oh, like what? Are you <laughs> you 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 mad? You mad that I'm cuter than you? That I'm hotter than you? And I don't even have to look like that? <laughs> yeah. I. Uh, you mad that my fursona oh. has fatter tits than you do? What are you gonna do? <laughs> So I've also just been uh, informed mm -hmm. that um, so the second Sonic the Hedgehog movie, which um, you know mm -hmm. is not out yet, new place. <clears throat> um, but uh, Paramount Studios has already announced two more Sonic movies. Huh. Meaning, I guess if the first one is anything to go by, they're expecting this one to do well. 
I just want to see <laughs> Shadow. <laughs> well, here's the funny part. Um, because it's uh, Yaiba who's telling me. Um, Sun Hedgehog 3 and Knuckles movie and a Knuckles spinoff. Hmm. Uh, Sega also wants Paramount to dive into other characters, and people are speculating Shadow and Metal Sonic. Oh, Metal Sonic would look good. <laughs> probably, he probably. I think I think they could make Metal Sonic look really fucking good in that in the 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 correct style. <laughs> I mean, when we were seeing um, what are basically the like plastic model stand-ins mm. um for the movie, and like people already saw. You know, we were already seeing Knuckles, and again, this was, like, not even uh, with the CG. This was just, again, these plastic yeah. models that they have um, for the actors to act off of. Yeah. <laughs> Which I think it's neat that they have that. But... It helps with, like, uh, with keeping movie, them acting in, like, a consistent scale. Yeah, when those uh, leaked out and uh, we were like, oh, so this is what Knuckles look like. Uh, looks like, we were just like, oh, it looks like knuckles yeah I don't, know, I don't, know, how like they, knuckles. don't know how they fucked up so bad with sonic originally <laughs> um the answer to that is that it was a and this is always what fucks up a lot of designs it was a de design by committee mm. meaning it was a design by a bunch of executive heads who, who don't understand yeah don't get like, the appeal don't understand they don't understand uh, an appealing design. They're like, it's supposed to be realistic, right? Otherwise, how are how are the kids gonna believe it? Yes, realistic because all yeah. hedge all hedgehogs have normal fucking square teeth. They don't, you know, they don't, they don't, they don't have. They don't have yeah. <laughs> I wonder what the other characters would have looked like if they had that style. What would tails and knuckles look like? I don't want to think about it too much. I don't either, I but it just sounds it just sounds funny. They just use the fucking Ugandan knuckles. Like, straight up. Just because they're like, oh, this is the funny meme. People it's will still, like it. It's still voiced by Aegis Elba, though. Yeah. So it's just Aegis Elba, like, um... It's like, <laughs> yeah, just like really dramatic and like... <laughs> My instead of instead of just like do I look like I need your power just do I look like I don't know the way do I do <laughs> which I will I will say like um they you know it, it was announced also even though even though I prefer like I do have a soft spot for Knuckles' old like dumb shit vibe they fucking yeah. nailed it <laughs> with the voice with like using Idris as Knuckles' voice yeah that was like amazing casting mm. um it's, we once. haven't even seen the moving and we're still just like that's that was a good choice mm. <laughs> I'm just worried it's... of I'm just worried of if they're ever gonna do Rugabat <laughs> <laughs> mm. Worried on both t on both sides of the spectrum of like either they make her look horrible and everyone hates it, or they make her look good but inaccurate and everyone starts yeah. drawing her like that and not like the original yeah. design. <laughs> I, it's gonna be something where I don't know. I, if they get to the point where they're putting in more Sonic characters, mm. like Rouge, like like E102, um, you know. I would love, robot, okay, I would whatever. love to see Gamma yeah. in in that, like, real style. I, like, if they start doing Sonic Adventure stuff in the movies, mm. um, first off, we would be like, okay, well, now we know these actors are gonna be in it for the long haul. This is pretty much now, like, the video game Marvel Avengers. Yeah. <laughs> it's Sonic. <laughs> I still think so. That also does remind. Ah, I'm like, I'm jumping around a lot, but I want to get back to Knuckles and how, like, uh, supposedly, um, I haven't seen these interviews. I've just been told that, um, in interviews, Idris Elba said that, um, he didn't, he, he wanted to try and not make Knuckles sound sexy. Oh, he failed. Uh, <laughs> upon further reflection, he's failed spectacularly. I refuse to believe that's true. I don't think he tried. I don't think... <laughs> well, Eater's Elba's voice is just naturally like, oof. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, I, ca I can't say much as a uh, not man lover. No. <laughs> Oh yeah, but I it, totally get it that. is a good fucking voice. Like, a, obviously, I don't think obviously voice. I don't think it's sexy, but it is a good voice. Yeah. Um. So definitely you <laughs> failed at not making Knuckles sexy, <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's. I also honestly really... that's more of my thing of like Rouge, just like. How she looks, I, they, they'll probably do well. I don't doubt that. But it's more yeah. of like, I'm worried on who they'll cast for the voice of yeah. Rouge. Because it's like, it's not it's not really a unique voice to say, but it's specific. I, I feel like, I don't know, because we know that the voice actor of Tails is voicing Tails. Yeah. The OG. Because like I don't want them. Well, not o not OG OG, but like you know, the, uh, more more official than just yeah. some some dude, or I guess not dude in some cases. <laughs> My Twitch keeps doing this thing where like the chat like flickers for a moment. Uh. I'm gonna refresh the page real quick. Twitch might just be dying. Yeah, there's a good chance that Twitch is just dying again. Um, so, I don't know, who, who do you think, as an actress, who do you think could voice Bruce the Bat if it wasn't a, uh, just, you know, one of her voice actors? See, the, prob the problem with that is that I don't know many. I don't know, like, any voice actresses. <laughs> yeah. Even less so who I think would fit the Ruga Bat. Is that because it is a specific style? Yeah. Like there's a specific tone to it. Yeah. That you're both. That is both like seductive, but you're totally in control. Hmm. Damn, dominatrix. <laughs> <laughs> Who do we know that has played a dominatrix before in movies? I don't know. They just, they just get, oh, I just forgot her name, but they just get the actor for Bayonetta, and so... You know what? Just, I could see that. She's just, she's, just, she's, just, she's just English now. I could honestly, I could honestly hear that. Like, that, I can hear that working. I say that like, as a joke, not Because, like, not, like, like Idris Elba as Knuckles doesn't sound like Knuckles, but it fits. Yeah. I can see that as well with, like, Bayonetta's voice actor as Rug. Rugi Bat. Yeah. Rogue the bat. I, <laughs> like, um, I remember I spoke about it with my brother. Um, mm. you know, the person voicing Sonic. It was like, after watching the movie, it was like, you know, it, it worked. Hmm. It like it, you know, after getting rid of <laughs> the terrible original CG design. Yeah. Um, with the current one, it was like this works. This actually just works, and you can tell that like he actually cared about the role. Doing, yeah. Uh, yeah, about playing the role and playing it right. Right. Um, because he adds little nuances that are like, you know, yeah, this is very Sonic like, yeah, almost comic Sonic like. Huh. Which is good. Yeah, which is very good. Better and, than the games uh, and like the series, honestly. Like if they make I'm... if they make the characters act and like relate more to the story of the comics, I'm all for it. Yeah. <laughs> I uh, I remember one of the big things I asked him after the movie was, um, do you think you could see him playing Sonic in the games? And I could, I could I see it. I, yeah, that's how we all felt. Like, you know, I can see it. I could see him, like, voicing Sonic, like, in the games, not hmm. just the movie. Yeah. So, I don't know. It's, it's weird to say, like, cons uh, considering Sonic's tricky, not-so-great transitioning into 3D and whatever shitty game reviewers say that they keep <laughs> yeah. harping on, using yeah. the same line over and over. <laughs> um... Just, just say you don't like Sonic 06. Like, yeah. 
Like, that, cause that like, is like, that is always the game. There's like the one really bad 3D Sonic game. The other ones are fine. I mean, Un uh, Unleashed, I personally don't like it, but it's not a bad game. Colors, great game. Generations, great game. Lost World, never played it. <laughs> Heard Teddy talk earlier? Well, you're too late, so get out of here. <laughs> no, don't don't leave, please. I, I, I need attention. I'm lonely. I'm poor. But I'm here. I need money. <laughs> yeah. You're here, which is why other people are here. XD. Big dysphoria about it. That's not allowed. It's my job. I can from Guilty Gear. Mm. Uh, I don't know. I, I can see... <clears throat> I can see that being like, you know, quote-unquote trans goals or whatever. Mm. But I... I just want to look like me but a woman. <laughs> yeah, that's too. Hmm. Sorry, I had to just wait for the toot. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, I I agree with that sentiment. Where I just want to look like me, but a woman, which yeah, I guess yeah. would be you know a rounder face. Um. Uh, I, I know I was talking about on, on the private server earlier, you know, I was just like, <laughs> update on my thighs, they are borderline mm. pillows. Hmm. <laughs> and that's, it's without HRT. Lamau. Kinda same, cause I had, I, I said it on my private account a while ago, or like earlier today, I've been putting on weight. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm glad about that, like I used to be fucking skinny. <clears throat> yeah. The one time that I've seen your, uh, the one time that I've seen your face, um, yeah, you were very, very skinny. Yeah, I mean, even though I've put on weight, my jaw is still fucking ugly, so I can't change that. Mm. <laughs> I still look like I... a, f I still look like a fucking octagon. <laughs> <laughs> See, you say that, and all I imagine is Jack Black's face just like, with that <laughs> big grin pointing at a stop sign. Yeah. He's pointing at my face. <laughs> Octagon. He's, he's, he's zooming in on your face, uh, shoving oh, the God, stop no. sign. Gross. Can you imagine, uh, like, I, I know I said, can you imagine uh, a lot, but Jack Black showing up in your dream with the stop sign, and then uh, as the stop sign gets closer and closer, it finally just like hits your face in the dream and that's uh because you're hit by the big stop you just wake up mm, yeah probably it's because he told you to stop stop dreaming back to reality yeah eh, i don't want to go back to reality no take me back <laughs> hey yeah <laughs> i don't i don't uh, look fucking times... ugly in my dreams i don't know <laughs> no most times in my my dreams are either weird or scary um, my uh, my know. dreams are either weird or sexual. <laughs> I okay. <laughs> or both. I've talked, about or this. I've talked about this with a few people, but I will say it on stream. I I maybe had a sexual dream twice in my life. Hmm. And I mean in my. Life. Like I don't even have like not even like in fa like fantasy sexual dreams. It's just like more just like I don't know, just doing just like n again like the normal or like the weird dreams, but everyone's hot. <laughs> I get that. But I even I mean in general I throughout my entire life I've only mm. had two dreams that could be technically classified as sexual. I mean, and I just don't it, remember like, most of my dreams, so that's one part no, of it. I don't but, either. Hmm. but I, I, I hate the fact that like most of the dreams I do remember, they are either um, they are either scary hmm. or they're just weird. A lot of my it's dreams like, just kind of, they're kind of just me like in the situation of like something I've done or like something I've watched. 
So like, yeah. I'm gonna be gonna be very cringe. <laughs> I've had a lot of Five Nights at Freddy's related dreams recently. <laughs> <laughs> More just because like, obviously playing the, and destroying the fuck out of Security Breach, and just watching a lot of videos about it, it's kind of seeped into my memory. <laughs> And like, not even right. like the spooky, like, ooh, edgy, like, j it'll even just be like, me just in the games. Like, me just, yeah. me just in Security Breach, running around, and doing shit. Right. <laughs> even with like, the glitchy nuances of like, shit happening in those games, will like, yeah. be a part of the dream, and it's fucking stupid. And like, that also being part of the, uh, sexual dreams of like, yeah. if I'm talking about like, ideas between you, Cream, and like, everyone else a lot, I will dream about those ideas. <laughs> I get that. Mm. See, uh, to be honest with you, I, I wish I could have those dreams. I mm. genuinely do. I, I don't, because I, I wake up and then I'm like, oh, it's just not real. It's not. Well, even, even then, it's like. I just I'm tired of having nightmares. I get that. I do I do have some very some very uh not nice nightmares from time to time. Yeah, nice just, nightmares? No. <laughs> I just I just mean nightmares that don't fuck me up for the rest of the week. <laughs> uh, a lot of the time I have the lot I have those <laughs> especially around the start of the year. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, well, I was gonna say something and I forget. I feel like something you should do, and I, I've been doing this more lately, it's like, when I have a weird dream or a nightmare, I, um, I just, like, quickly write it down. Hmm. I never, I, I never do that. I keep, I, I did want to do it at some point, but I kept forgetting. Unsurprisingly. Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> I, I, that's what I was gonna say, like... I kind of hate those dreams because they kind of they kind of boost my dysphoria. Because <laughs> in those because right. in those dreams I'm like I'm in my sona's body when I'm having those dreams, and then I wake up and right. I'm like, ah, oh, I'm back in this fucking piece of shit. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't say I've ever I've never even had like a furry related dream. I've mm. just it's more just know, like I the reason I have dreams like that is because. I, I don't know how a lot of you look. So I just imagine, like, I mean, I know how you look, but like Cream yeah. and like everyone else, like, I don't know how these pe you guys look. So I just imagine you guys as your Sona. Even when I'm like talking, even when I'm like talking to Cream or Alex or like anyone else that I haven't seen their real face, I just imagine them as their characters because because uh, my like brain, my brain, ha my brain has to put a face onto something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you do you imagine Relic as just like a small angry cat? <laughs> no, I I do put him like in like his actual like more anthro sona a lot of the time, but sometimes I do turn him into little shit. Dot png. <laughs> like when he's oh yeah when he's when he's being a shithead with some of his jokes. Hmm. Sometimes, sometimes if he is like on an angry rant about a video game, I just imagine he, he's a tiny little cat. <laughs> yeah, it's just squeaking. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. That kind of thing is just funny to me. Hmm. It's always funny just imagining a tiny little creature that's like yelling about bullshit. A little about creature. Bullshit. Yeah, that should be me. When when I'm getting mad, uh, you just you should just imagine me as a gremlin, gremlin Ashley. <laughs> With Payday 2 music playing. <laughs> wee, wee. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. Let's see. Next time you go on a rant about um, Twitch is, you know, bad, I'll just, mm. <clears throat> just imagine <laughs> that music playing. <laughs> But you know what? I was, I will still, I will still definitely brag. I am pretty much the reason that people say gremlin most of the time now, because <laughs> I, w I don't remember anyone saying it before, like saying gremlin as often as they do now. But I started using it because of my like, the original old like little shit drawing that I had. Yeah. Because like usually everyone would just say chibi, 
Like, that's what people yeah. would say. But th because my, like, my little uh, chibi was specifically stupid looking, I always, called yeah. him a I always called them a gremlin. And then because, obviously, the person who drew it was insanely popular, everyone else started yeah. doing it. And now I'm just like, ha, ah, I'm here too. <laughs> well, I remember there was, like, I want to say it was, like, in 2020. Mm -hmm. Someone did, like, a, a post where um, it was, like, a... Uh, name something that you're famous for hmm yeah i saw and, that uh, and like i even considered bringing that up but i was like man no one cares no <laughs> i wouldn't care because i actually didn't i didn't think about it until right now mm. and yeah you're right it wasn't until after meeting you but you know and that's how the gremlin dafang became to be yeah like i'm the reason gremlin as a term is commonly used now Get yeah, instead fucked. of chibi, just gremlin. Yeah. Crazy how that kind of thing just turns out. Yeah, and we cool. don't we don't even think about the source. Hmm. Yeah. Like there is this gif. Um it it's not very commonly seen now, but it's the original gif is just uh this guy, he um He's uh, in his car and he just he sees something and he uh, pulls up his sunglasses and he's got like uh, he's got like little f uh, fake goofy eyes in it as a joke. Mm. Um, and the camera zooms in on uh, on these joke eyes. <laughs> um, I used a bot on Telegram uh, called Distort Bot. You can guess what it does. Mm. And I just had it distort the GIF and. Um, I would use it uh, as a way to reply to things, you know, just in a funny way. And now you and... see it everywhere. <laughs> no, uh, there was a point where I was seeing it all the time, <laughs> and I felt, and I felt like saying, you know, I'm actually the one who made that gif. <laughs> but like you, it's Le like no one really cares. Le mal, funny weed <laughs> number. <laughs> so sorry, I was, I was yeah, being yeah. stupid. <laughs> Gone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby. That's good shit. <laughs> I can't. I can't sound like a stoner unless I'm actually smoking weed. I mean, that makes sense. Honest to God, so I think this is actually good. Uh, a good stopping point. But I'm just gonna quickly say, mm -hmm. I think it'd be really funny if I just did one of these streams or even a Friday stream. Just like fucking baked. That would be. F I would fucking love that. I mean, <laughs> I won't. See, like, I won't be baked because I don't smoke the weed. But I would. I would do that for like a drunk stream. <laughs> like, I dr I drink. You smoke. Like <laughs> you're you're drunk. I'm high off my ass, and so you're just slurring words, and I'm just listening to you, and I'm just like. It's like I'm like yeah. slur I'm slurring all of my words, making no sense, and you're just like, yeah, man. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. No, I don't just, like I'd be nodding my head and I was like, yeah, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Never thought of it that way. You're right. That's deep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. At some point sense. you're just like, ah, I love you, man. <laughs> <laughs> I turned Jamaican. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> I love you, man. I love, oh, I love it. Bitch. I explode. Fuck. Yeah, fuck it. I'm done for tonight. <laughs> I'm tired. Sounds like a plan. I'm sick as fuck. I don't need the alive. Uh. <laughs> So, that all said. Hmm. Alright. It's been a good day. Ah, yeah. I'll be playing yeah, because of tomorrow, because I didn't do it on Monday. And then I'll be playing it again on Thursday. <laughs> Sounds 
sounds good. So, we that was nice. See, yeah, it was fun. We talked about stupid shit. As no always. one listened. <laughs> As and always. Now, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> so, till tomorrow. Uh, bye bye.